The search engine Yahoo was once a titan of the internet, valued at over $125 billion during the dot-com boom. But today, it is remembered as a cautionary tale of missed opportunities and bad decisions. So why did it fail? In the 1990s, Yahoo was an internet pioneer, offering a directory of websites, emails, and news. But as the internet evolved, so did its competition. The rise of companies like Google and Facebook exposed the Yahoo's inability to adapt. One pivotal moment was its decision to pass on the opportunity to acquire Google for a mere five $5 billion in 2002. This decision allowed Google to take the throne of online search and advertising and became the go-to search engine for decades to come. From the late 1990s through the 2010s, Yahoo experienced a constant change of chief executives. The lack of continuity in the leadership meant that the company lacked a clear and long-term vision and a strategic direction. Meanwhile, Yahoo's advertising business, which was the core of its revenue, struggled to compete with Google and Facebook, who offered better targeting and analytics. In 2000. In 2017, Yahoo was sold to Verizon for just $4.5 billion. Today, Yahoo serves as a reminder that success in tech requires constant innovation and clear focus.